Barbara Oakley, A Mind for Numbers, How to Excel at Math and Science, Even if You Flunked Algebra. Embark on a journey to unlock your mind's potential with A Mind for Numbers, How to Excel at Math and Science, Even if You Flunked Algebra, a brilliantly insightful book by Barbara Oakley. Gain an in-depth understanding of the two modes of thinking, focused and diffuse, and learn how to incorporate them to enhance your learning abilities. Unravel the mysteries of the human brain and its extraordinary capacity for chunking information, allowing for efficient information processing. Discover how to combat procrastination, regulate stress management, and nurture a healthy, productive work environment. Take control of your learning process by harnessing creativity, using mnemonic devices, building connections, and tapping into the power of testing. Balancing Focused and Diffuse Thinking Our brains possess two distinct thinking networks, focused and diffuse. Focused thinking allows us to concentrate on familiar concepts and solve problems using rational, analytical thought, while diffuse thinking provides a broader perspective, helping us understand the big picture. Balancing these two modes helps us approach various learning tasks more efficiently and gain deeper insights. For instance, in language learning, we use focused thinking to build on previous knowledge, and diffuse thinking to see things from a new angle. Recognizing the importance of utilizing both thinking modes is key to unlocking our full learning potential. Mastering Focused and Diffuse Modes To optimize learning and problem solving, we must switch between focused and diffuse modes of thinking. The key is understanding that both modes are essential and must be alternated to ensure our brain's health, efficiency, and memory retention. Sleep helps reset our minds and facilitates deeper understanding of the topics we've been pondering. So, when faced with a challenging concept, take breaks and allow your mind to wander or catch a quick nap to give yourself the best opportunity to comprehend and internalize new information. Throughout our daily lives, we naturally alternate between focused and diffuse modes of thinking, playing crucial roles in our learning process. For understanding complex problems and acquiring new concepts, it's important to have periods when we aren't consciously fixated on the issue, engaging our diffuse mode. This allows us to consolidate insights and make sense of the bigger picture. The learning process involves constant back-and-forth communication between the two modes as one processes information and shares results with the other. This steady collaboration allows us to work effectively toward solutions. Sleep is a vital component in learning, comparable to rest days when building muscles. Our brain requires periods of rest to refresh and enhance our ability to think. Sleeping rids the brain of toxic products and strengthens memory retention. Research even suggests that reviewing material before sleep can provoke dreaming about it, further enhancing understanding. So, if you find yourself struggling with a concept, Change your thinking mode or catch some Z's to boost your learning progress. Mastering the Art of Chunking The human mind is exceptionally powerful, and one of its remarkable capabilities is chunking, which plays a crucial role in learning and gaining expertise in various fields. Chunking is the process of grouping related pieces of information into meaningful units or chunks, allowing our brain to process complex ideas in a more efficient manner. As we learn, we build a mental library of chunked concepts, helping us solve problems swiftly by recognizing different types and classes of problems. To build chunks effectively, it's essential to focus on understanding basic ideas and then practicing them in context. Don't just passively read while studying, but practice recalling the information to solidify new chunks in your memory, ultimately speeding up problem solving and enhancing cognitive abilities. Overcoming Procrastination in Learning Treat learning math and science like a marathon rather than a sprint, spreading your learning over time to avoid procrastination. Focus on the process of learning, engaging in regular study sessions and allowing time for the knowledge to settle. This will help you stay calm and motivated as you progress, preventing procrastination and making learning more enjoyable. If you suddenly tried to train for a marathon the night before, your calf muscles would protest in pain. Similarly, trying to cram math and science knowledge at the last minute is setting yourself up for failure. 
Procrastination is an alluring trap, providing momentary relief from a daunting task, especially when a subject is dull, complicated, or anxiety-inducing. To excel in math and science, you must conquer procrastination. It's important to break your study into smaller sessions, likened to laying bricks of information and allowing them to dry in between. Spread your learning over time, as trying to absorb everything quickly won't work. A key to overcoming procrastination is shifting focus from the end product to the learning process itself. When you allocate specific time to study and enjoy the process, you'll worry less about immediate results, easing self-judgment. This approach keeps procrastination at bay, making it easier to tackle challenging goals without fear or discomfort. Consequently, not only will you prevent procrastination, but you'll also learn to enjoy the journey. Mastering Productivity Hacks Great achievers often credit their success to effective tricks they've installed in their lives. Boost your productivity by finding a dedicated workspace, practicing mindfulness training, and reframing your focus. Additionally, create achievable to-do lists and maintain a planner, ensuring a balance of work and play. David Allen, a renowned management specialist, observed that the highest-performing individuals often have the best tricks up their sleeves. Here are some simple yet effective hacks to enhance your productivity. Discover where you work best, a bustling cafe, a peaceful library, or a dedicated workspace. Customizing your work environment helps fend off procrastination. Take advantage of mindfulness training, akin to meditation, to ignore distractions and stay focused. Relaxing exercises, like counting numbers, train your mindfulness muscles. Shift your attention from negativity by reframing your focus. For instance, when struggling to get out of bed, don't dwell on fatigue, think about the delicious breakfast that awaits. Regularly create achievable to-do lists to gain control over your habits and take stock of the bigger picture. Maintain a planner journal to keep you organized and on track. While allocating time for tasks, remember to balance work and play, as planned leisure activities can help prevent unwarranted procrastination. Embrace these tricks, and soon you'll witness a remarkable improvement in your productivity. Unleash your memory power. To enhance memory retention, make information meaningful by using creativity, metaphors, and acronyms. For instance, assign imaginative stories to scientific principles, like remembering Newton's second law, F equals MA, by associating F with flying, M with mules, and T with apples. Metaphors facilitate understanding by drawing similarities between subjects, such as picturing electrical currents as water flow. Visualizing yourself as an element of a concept could also prove helpful. Acronyms, like memorizing plant names, garlic, rose, hawthorn, and mustard, with the acronym GRHM, can significantly simplify learning materials. By employing memorable sentences where each word's first letter represents a term, you create stories that are easier to remember due to inherent associations. The Overlooked Genius Working alongside highly intelligent individuals may be daunting, but being an average student has its own merits. A strong work ethic and creativity can offer advantages over those who may understand concepts faster. Gifted individuals, sometimes prone to overthinking, may overlook simpler solutions due to their longer working memory. In contrast, individuals with average working memories can derive creative ideas from a variety of brain areas. By consistently practicing, seeking persistence in learning, and thinking independently, these average minds can achieve great feats and match the accomplishments of their gifted peers. Unleashing the testing effect. Tests are more than just a measurement of knowledge, they're a powerful learning tool that can improve retention, facilitate learning, and help us handle stress. The testing effect, explored by psychologists Julie Campbell and Richard Meyer, demonstrates that testing throughout learning, such as during a lecture, leads to better overall performance. This positive impact occurs even when the test performance is poor or without feedback. Students can also benefit from reinterpretation of stress symptoms as excitement and practicing deep breathing to reduce anxiety. By recognizing the importance of testing and embracing these techniques, students can enhance the overall learning experience and perform more effectively in exams.
A Mind for Numbers revelatory exploration of the inner workings of the brain offers groundbreaking strategies for learning, recollection, and problem solving. By mastering the focused and diffuse modes and understanding their unique strengths, you will enhance your learning experiences and improve problem-solving skills. The book places strong emphasis on avoiding procrastination, implementing effective study habits, and embracing mental tricks to promote productivity while reducing stress. Embrace the power of chunking, metaphors, and memory techniques to bolster your recall capabilities, and use testing as a transformative tool for achieving your academic goals. Remember that persistence, practice, and hard work often hold the key to success, regardless of innate intelligence.